You're watching ESC News. Thank you for joining us. The Chinese army will not hesitate to go to war and fight to the end in case anyone dares to secede Taiwan from China, said State Councilor and Defense Minister Wei Feng on Sunday in a speech delivered at the ISSS Shangri-La Dialogue in Singapore during the Asian Security Summit. The Chinese army will not hesitate to go to war and fight to the end. In case anyone dares to suicide Taiwan from China, said the Council of Defence Minister Wei Feng He on Sunday in a speech delivered to the Shanghai Delong in Singapore. In case anyone dares to split Taiwan from China, we, the Chinese army, will surely not hesitate to go to war, fight at all costs and fight to the end. This is the only choice for China. Here, I'd also warn the Taiwan sensationalists and forces behind them speaking to split. Taiwan from China is dead end, which simply is a delusion. To be savagely dependent on foreigners to gain some recognition will never work and those who embrace the idea should stop daydreaming, said we. China has made impressive progress in developing new nuclear weapons, but will only use them for the self-defense and never use them first. Chinese Defence Minister Wei Fenghe told delegates on the Shangri-La Dialogue on Sunday. In response to a question about reports last year on constructions more than 100 nuclear missile silos in China's east, he said China has always pursued an appropriate path to develop nuclear capabilities for protection of our country. He said the ultimate goal of China's nuclear arsenal was to prevent nuclear war. We've developed nuclear capabilities to protect the hard work of the Chinese people and protect our people from the source of the nuclear warfare, he said. The three-day summit was held in Singapore from Friday to Sunday after two years suspensions due to COVID-19 pandemic. The summit focused on security in the Asian Pacific region and viable solutions.